The eruption is ongoing and incredibly the mountain was crystal clear behind me an hour ago, but now the wind has shifted. All the ash which was going that way has now come back across blocking out the volcano and that is good news for Europe because it means the ash is finally headed in the other direction. Now yesterday, you're right, we did have a chance to finally land the first ones to do so on the volcano. It was incredible and all the more impressive to see right up close. What does it look like to you? It looks like it's still really going, even though they say it's slowing down. It's not slowing down. It's just the wind has changed. Look to your left now, Neil. You'll see a house there. Now you can hardly see it. It's, it's all covered. Oh, yeah, that one. We're getting ready to land now. We're just due north of the volcano as it's erupting, and we're going to set down on some ash, and we're told we can spend about five minutes tops. We've just landed, and I'm walking in thick ash mixed with ice. Look where we are. The eruption is going on right here. We're actually standing on the volcano. All of this is from the eruption over just the last few days. It's ash mixed with snow. You can see behind me some of these huge black pieces. This is not just the small ash that we've been seeing elsewhere, but actually some very large chunks. We're getting a pretty big one right now that you can see coming up. Can't feel the explosions. In fact, they're silent. You can just see the power of it. It's magnificent. It's actually hard to breathe here. It's so windy and cold. After leaving the volcano, my chest actually feels strange. My lungs feel almost as if they've been chilled by the freezing air. And some of these gusts come through and, and it's just blinding. We drove back to the farm we visited yesterday to see how they were holding up. It wasn't good. This is the same place I stood just 24 hours ago. You can see where I rubbed my boot to show the muddy substance, but now it's, it's hard. The ash has dried almost like cement. I don't know how they're gonna get this up. Sadly, more ash is falling there again today. Cleaning up for some of Iceland's largest farms is going to be a nightmare.